Hey, what's going on? It's your boy BZ, and I came here to talk some boxing with the hundreds and hundreds of true school sports subscribers. What's going on, guys? Now, a bit of news regarding the 2016 and potential fights that could be made. It's being reported from the Amiri Mom camp down here in South Florida and on various boxing news outlets that Amiri Mom is targeting a rematch with Adrian Granados, whom we lost to few months ago or not too long ago he's targeting a rematch with Granados for early 2016 uh, Stacey McKinley has told uh, several uh, boxing news outlets BoxingScene.com being the most notable one that uh, Amiri Mom wants a rematch for a guy in Granados who was supposed to be a stay busy fight now when we look at him when we look at Imam when we look at you know just three or four months ago how he was viewed to how he's viewed now it's, it's, it's night and day Three or four months ago, Imam was the one of the hottest, one of the most uh, hyped up and talked about prospects in the sport of boxing, and people were very excited for him. And, and you know, he 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 has to stay busy fight with Granados, and you know, I'll be very honest. I I, I interviewed Amir Imam while he was while, while he was in camp for the Granados fight, and you can see I'm gonna put the annotation right here. You can see it. Uh, he, I asked him about his upcoming fight. This is about a month before it, the Granados fight, and he didn't even know who Granados was. He he didn't know who Granados was. He didn't know his name. He wasn't familiar familiar with him. So I don't want to say a mere. Uh, I don't want to assume that he was overlooking his opponent, but that's what it looked like when I interviewed him. You know, and you know, as we know in boxing, you can never underestimate anybody. It doesn't matter how good you are, how you know bad you perceive them to be. You got to prepare every fight. Prepare for every fight like it's your last, and go in there for war. And Amir might have uh, had, a, had had maybe maybe there was some lapses in his preparation for that fight, which is why he didn't win. Uh, Granados is a pressure fighter, pressured Amir all night. Amir had a really hard time sticking his jab, like like he usually does against guys, because he, he was getting smothered uh, by Granados, and Granados was able to really piece up Amir and Mom real good now. Exclusive information only here on True School Sports. I'll tell you guys. Uh, last time I went to the Heavyweight Factory, I uh, was I was there for Shannon Briggs and his celebratory 44th birthday open workout to the public. I was there for that. I interviewed him. That's on the channel as well. And after our interview, I we, we were just talking about some stuff, some boxing stuff, and he told me uh, we, we were talking about Amir, and he told me that Amir and Mom went into that fight sick with the flu. So maybe it affected him, maybe it didn't, but you know, no excuses. This is boxing. You don't want to make excuses for him, but that could have had a, an effect. But he's got, he's got, he's got to go out there and he's got to prove and, uh, himself and avenge that, avenge this loss. Because right now, at this point, for a Miriam Mom, it's sink or swim. You lost a stay busy fight to a guy who was like eighteen and three, or sixteen and four, something like that, and. You know, you were supposed to go on there and ice him and destroy him, and, and, and he would have been in line for the Victor Postal fight. But now that he lost, this is kind of taking his name out of the hat for the Victor Postal fight, and he's got to fight his way back up. So Amir's got, got, got some 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 things he has to go work on. He has some things in the drawing board he's got to really look at. But it is what it is. Amir Mom looking at a rematch with Adrian Granados early 2016. This is what we're hearing on. Um, from numerous boxing out from bo numerous boxing outlets and from the Amir Mom camp. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, it, is Amir Mom a hype job to you, or was it just a bad night? And do you still see him as a major player at 140 pounds? Take the time to subscribe, like this video, share it, all that good stuff. And until next time, take care, guys. Salute.